Hey everyone, in this video, we're gonna see what is Medicare insurance. In the previous video, we saw the basic outline of what is Medicare insurance, like who implemented the Medicare insurance into law and who's eligible to get the Medicare coverage. If you haven't watched the video yet, the link is above, please go and check it out. In order to get the Medicare insurance, a person or his spouse has to pay taxes for at least 10 years. Once they pay the taxes, they're eligible for Medicare coverage after the age of 65. If the person is less than 65 with permanent disability or end-stage kidney disease, they are also eligible to get the Medicare coverage. Now we will see parts of Medicare. Medicare has four parts, part A, part B, part C, and part D. Firstly, we have part A, also known as hospital insurance, which covers inpatient care in hospital setting, skilled nursing facility, home health care, and hospice care. Little confusing, right? Let me explain in detail. Inpatient means when a patient is admitted into a hospital and stayed at least a night under the supervision of a doctor or nurse is called inpatient. And Medicare Part A covers all the hospital related bills. Now we will see what is skilled nursing facility. Under the supervision of skilled nurses and equipment, treatment is given to patient under a skilled nursing facility. Now we will see what is hospice care. When a patient is about to die within 6 months, they can choose to have a hospice care. There is no treatment given to the patient to cure the problem because they are anyway going to die within a 6 months. So what the provider will do is they will give pain relief, skilled nursing care and they help with daily activities. Now we will see what is home health care. When a patient is in home and need medical care due to chronic issues like diabetes or blood pressure or after any injury or after surgery, therapist and nurses comes to patient home and provide services. Next we have Medicare Part B which is also known as medical insurance. Once a person gets free Part A Medicare, they can choose to have Part B Medicare, but they have to pay for it. What? But they have already paid 10 years of taxes, right? That is not how it works. Part A is free after 10 years of taxes, but for other parts of Medicare, they have to pay the premiums. Medicare Part B covers outpatient care, DME services, and preventive services. Outpatient care means when a patient visits the doctor and returning back to the home on the same day is called outpatient care. The abbreviation for DME is durable medical equipment such as wheelchairs, walkers, and etc. Preventive services like vaccines, screenings, and wellness visits. I hope you know about vaccines but you are not sure about wellness and screening tests, right? Okay, let me explain it. Screening test is a test used to detect disease at the early stage. For example, mammography is used to detect the breast cancer at the early stage. Wellness visit is a yearly checkup. Patient visits the doctor's office every year even though they don't have any health issues. Next is Medicare for C coverage which is also known as Medicare Advantage plan where private insurances contracts with Medicare and follows Medicare guidelines and they provide more and more benefits to the Medicare patients. Medicare patients can choose Medicare Advantage plan if they need more benefits. In the upcoming video, we will see in-depth concepts in Medicare Advantage plan. Finally, we have Part D coverage also known as prescription drug coverage. It covers patients prescription drug. I hope you have learned a lot from this video. Follow me for more medical billing and coding related videos.